Hello, 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 and welcome back, art lovers. It is me talking about basically anything that comes to my mind. <laughs> okay, before we begin, I just want to say that this is an art challenge that I have given myself and that I have created myself. It's a challenge that, um, that will kind of remind me of why I started art and what kind of like triggered me into the art world and that was my childhood shows. If it wasn't for my childhood shows, I wouldn't have become this illustrator, artist, you know, that likes concept and music and trying to be, you know, an actress. I don't, you know, I don't know what I'm talking about right now. Anyway, so uh, when I was just thinking about like a challenge for myself because I was just, you know, rambling in my head like it was so cool to go back to the days we you know disney channel with all that kind of cool shows and the nice movies way back in 2000s and i'm just like oh my gosh i want to like go back to that because i was that person who had who like you know always like watching tv and i just watched so many shows that comes on like every single day and it just brings me back and one of those shows were uh, high school musical i was abusing that movies like i was literally watching it over and over and over and then when i look back right now i'm like why <laughs> why i I'm, I'm not really a big fan of it now like Maybe because I'm like, you know, I watched it so many times. I'm like, Ugh, I'm so bored with it now. <laughs> anyway, so I, my sinus is acting up again. Ugh. Every single time when it's like winter, it just comes. So yeah. Anyway. Um, so when I was thinking about all that stuff, I literally went to YouTube and watched all of the shows, like the theme songs, and I was watching High School Musical, um, the songs over and over and over until I get the, you know, the reference that I want, and then I was just like, oh, all the songs in my head now, <laughs> and when I was like thinking, like, I want to draw all of these characters not my favorite but like characters that you know plays a huge part in the series and like also in the, like you know the movies and stuff like that and then i just came to think like you know what let's draw troy and gabriella and i was like i haven't drawn them before and you know they were basically the first people we saw in the freaking movie and also the lost people so they play a huge part especially you know the other two characters the brother and sister i'm not gonna mention the name <laughs> that's for the other video anyway so i decided to just go with them and i was just thinking which part which which scene should i draw and then one of my favorite scenes uh like is when gabriella was gonna like leave and i was like yes <laughs> was i one of those people who was like yes leave because <laughs> you keep leaving <laughs> You know what? Just go. Just, just, just leave. Okay. Every time you say you're gonna leave, then you just come back anyways at the end of the movie. <laughs> anyway, so I really like the song. I like the sea, especially when they're on like this little bridge and there's like a lake behind it or the ocean. I don't know, but like I just like I just love that scene, especially with the lighting, with the blue and oh, the. I was just deciding, you know what, let's do this, let's do something we've never done before and draw a couple. Yes, I don't draw couples. So it was like the first time drawing a couple, especially in this sad scene. <laughs> and I don't draw like a lot of, how do I say lovey-dovey things? I don't do that. I, I, it's, it's all about the positive vibes, it's all about the singles out there, yes. I, yeah anyway we were so i just decided i couldn't find like a really good reference i just decided to like just draw them and there was lots of scenes where 
Gabriella is like on the left side, not on the right side. So it was complicated to get that kind of reference. And I was like, oh, what to do? And the most struggle part was the background. As you can see, I am struggling with the background, like, especially with the little lights. And Gabriella's hair was like so frustrating, like, just to get the highlights. And also to put the glow on that was like, so I was like okay take a break I can always come back here you can see I was struggling behind the freaking background I was thinking how do I get these lights these reference the references that I just got was like just so dark like I cannot actually see what the heck's happening and I wasn't like thinking oh I can just go on my iPad and just you know change the color and I was like, no, I'm just gonna follow the reference, even though the reference is so dark. I can't even see like their faces well because I have like say four references and none of them is the same pose. It's just swapped differently. Like the one I just got was like when um they like far away from the camera like the camera should have just landed on them but i just decided to go with that one which is so weird and i was like okay i got the characters down but the background <laughs> the background was <laughs> so you're me struggling with the background um I, I was okay with doing like the waves but the freaking lighting the lighting oh my gosh i thought it would be easy but like it's hard everything was okay except the freaking lights that's in the water that was the hardest part um i like how the shadows that's on the characters i love how i did choice here oh my gosh like i honestly i just did my own thing with his hair and i love it i love how it's so smooth i love how it's not all in your face it's just like a shape and her hair too i, I wasn't gonna follow the reference completely i wanted to do my own version of gabriella you know like something that has a soft feeling to the scene i don't want anything to be sticking out just them and the freaking lights in the water that's all i wanted to show i did not want anything else to show and there was a time where i was like getting so frustrated with like um the line work like i was just okay with the line work at first and i was like thinking wait i'm missing something and i had to look for other references and i realized oh i did not see this <laughs> you know when you get a reference and then you find other references from that one scene and you'll be like i did not see this ish so yeah guys don't just follow one reference follow four the limit is four if you want to add more go ahead but like yeah my references was like blurry and dark but boy have i just went through and just finished it <laughs> gosh so yeah i'm here trying to go with the details going into their faces changing the eye colors because i wasn't sure if i want to just you know make it brown like choice eyes is like you know blue but like not like dark blue so because his eyes here is like dark blue right now i wanted to stand out like i like how i make my character's eyes stand out and i wanted that to happen the main part at this moment right now is where i'm struggling with the stiletto stilettos is it stilettos is it called stilettos i don't know what it's called but it's a freaking word anyway so uh yeah it was looking too dark i was literally trying to follow the follow, follow the reference but like i'm <laughs> making it too dark i want them to stand out so i had to add glow like the blue glow as you can see what i'm doing right now i was like oh i have to learn this now so i was learning about a lot of things and honestly it was nice but it was stressful it was stressful yes it was stressful okay so 
so um at this point i was like oh gabriella your hair is so dark like it's blended into the background and i wasn't feeling that at all i was also not feeling that their skin was like so not mellow but like how do i say it's like there wasn't any nice contrast to it so i had to add more reds a little bit of some volume val volume to it and then i was oh okay we got this we getting there should i put some more dark volumes in there should i make it darker or lighter because in the references like Troy's hair is like light and I'm thinking to myself like should I just follow that because there's like the light brown and the dark brown and I was like you know I'm just gonna make it dark brown screw this ish same with her hair like there was probably a few lightings that just you know it was okay like her hair right now it's like so boring you can't even see any good textures or volumes to it and i was like oh what do i do and then i went through it and then i decided you know what let's let's just focus on them trying to stand out not to be dark not to be whatever but yeah the background felt so like it's getting there but like should i continue more or should i just leave it that way i don't know i was thinking about a lot of changes and yeah that happened <laughs> as you can see here i am trying to make sure the background has that kind of you know value to it <sighs> why did i say value now anyways it's getting there his shirt was a little bit annoying i was like you know what, let's add some light to it, not this plain normal looking shirt where there's no freaking anything into it. So yeah, I'm so glad I did this to his shirt. Her dress was so easy, so I'm glad about that. The expressions were really nice. I went over it a few times and made sure to like, you know, get that kind of expression that I want, not what viewers want to see on our ones because this 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 scene was so sad i want them to also cry to look like they are about to cry actually and um i was listening to the freaking song over and over and over i even downloaded so i can you know use it for my reel if you guys watched it on instagram <laughs> And yeah, here we go back to the lighting. <laughs> uh, the lighting on her was like exhausting. Like, oh, what to do? Should I make it just blue or should I make it with something else? His lighting on the other hand was was easy. It was it was not easy, but it was like it was I can do it, you know. Same with her eyes. I felt like the eyes was like so boring. So I went in with her eyes. I went on and on with the shadows in her face. Get more details, you know, going on there. And add a few glitters like I always do. <laughs> well, I was like, okay, I'm, I'm getting satisfied with this. This is, this is, it's, it's getting there. So I was like, we're gonna just stick to this part. We're not gonna go all over. We're not gonna be all exaggerated now anymore. Add some few tears. Save that shot. And then we save the other shot where there's no tears. Posted both, by the way. And then I was also thinking, let's make the background a little bit more blurry. <laughs> Add another multi layer at the back. <laughs> anyway, so yeah. We're just going through it again, the process, right now. I'm actually, I really like this artwork. I'm really glad how it turned out. And I hope you guys like it too. Anyways. Yeah. Okay, video. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.